Hey guys, in this tutorial, we're gonna learn a confirmation dialog box using a jQuery. So, when we uh, want to delete a record, uh, this is a dialog box and it says, uh, Do you really want to delete a record? If you cancel, a record will not be deleted. And when you uh, OK, a record has been deleted successfully. So, this is very useful thing. Uh, uh, for your website your web application and I'm doing uh, by PHP uh, MySQL and uh, jQuery right and also I'll use a bootstrap right so let's see a code and understand this functionality let me show you first a table a local host PHP my admin and uh, I'm using this database PHP app and inside we have a table which is post table so let's click on a post table and see this structure right so in this table we have id title content and link right if you have another table you can use it right so let's close this one and come here right so this is a serial number this is title i'm not putting any uh, link and the content and some other uh fields of a table i'm not putting just for understanding i'm just uh adding this title only and one delete button this operation action right when we click delete it says uh do you want do, do you really want to delete a card uh, yes or no right so this way uh, we can do right so let me show you a uh, uh, code for this tutorial so already i have a project and i will show you uh, each and every file and each and every line of code right so you will uh, it will help you a lot right so first file is index.php so let me zoom in so here i am using a bootstrap uh, main.js this is cdn file you can link uh, through a cdn i'm using bootstrap and then jquery 3.3.1 right and this is a bootstrap main.js file and this is a boot uh, bootbox.main.js so this is a plugin which i'm using so let me show you uh, you can get this plugin bootmax let's copy uh, this bootbox.main.js and you can search on google you will get a cdn file click on a first link and uh, guys here is a cdn file right you can just copy this file and you can add you can paste here right so uh, we have a scene uh, which technology we are using here bootstrap and jquery of something we are using right and then um, just simply let me show you first uh, HTML then we will see a uh, jQuery right so here is a HTML uh, I have added this config.php file I'll show you in a minute uh, this is a config file config.php and here is my config.php file and here just simply I have added my database connection host is localhost username is root password is blank and database name is PHP app which is this one php app right yeah and here is a mysql i connect uh, always we do like this host name username password and db name and if connection is not made it means something uh, wrong uh, means a uh, username and password and host name is something uh, wrong uh, it will die our connection connection failed and shows a specific error using mysql i connect error right so this is very simple uh, way to connect your mysql uh, php through php right so this file i have added or uh, here included php let me zoom in yeah config.php and here is a bootstrap container and inside we have a table which is this one and it's a border uh, its background is white smoke and here is a three fields serial number title and operation maybe you can add action of something right so this is action let me show you this action delete and also you can add a edit of this record 
right so three fields we have in a, in this table and just simply i'm uh, writing query uh select all from this post table which is this one yeah this post table which is here as well and i'm uh, se uh, selecting all the records from uh, this post table and this is my sql query it will take uh, two parameters connection and query connection is just this connection is coming from uh, here because this is a connection and this is a query which is this one right and count by default is one and id title and link so this is a while loop it will fetch all the records and convert to an array and we can get uh through row row and its id this id is exactly uh should be matched here this is id title content and link but we just want to title and link right and inside we have a uh, another row uh, it's it, it contains a uh, uh, count uh, this is count function right let me show you I think there is a problem one two three uh, no 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 there is no problem so this is a count means which is this one count is zero then uh, yeah here is a count zero uh, sorry one two and three of something and here is a title of your post and uh, after that we have a button right so this button uh, we will make action let me show you let me a little bit zoom out and let's close this one yeah so this is a button and this button is actually this button delete button and uh, have a uh, some class booster class delete btn btn danger its id is whatever uh, delete and the whatever id this first have uh, this first have right so its id uh, is let me post and uh, its id is 4 so del underscore 4 right del underscore 4 and the second one is del underscore 5 so whatever id we will add it here and uh, data id so data id also be uh, its id of the post and we have a delete button right and uh, count we are counting uh, this count plus plus means uh, it will first time is one and then second time it will while loop will uh, run uh, right so its id uh, would be a two three four five automatically incremented by one this is a count plus plus right and table is uh, uh i'm closing table here and here's a do tag and body and html right so you know well about this so this id so let's see a uh, uh, jquery right so this is a delete button which is this one this class this is a delete class and we have a uh, uh, added the click listener means uh, own click listener here when we click on a button so what dot element so whatever element is here so i'm inserting a this and this is a delete id right so dollar this dot data dot id means i'm targeting to this id which is data id is whatever id have this delete button particular delete button this one have a different id and this one have a different id so we are getting id through this variable right and bootbox have a, a function which is confirm and this is a, do you really want to delete a record which is this uh, message actually right and uh, this function uh, inside this function uh, uh, we are um, adding a ajax right so if request if something request this is result right sorry so this is result if result have a something means it's true right so we are adding a jquery ajax here so url is uh, ajax file dot php i'll show you in a minute this file is very important and type is post and id uh, data is id is deleted 
right so id and deleted and deleted is actually the id of the post of particular id right so we are sending the id of a particular post through this data right and if data response is equals to equals to one we are we have a little bit transaction paid in uh, we have uh, added the transaction and effects let me show you when we delete and yes here is a transaction background and it's a uh, uh, remove uh, tr means a table row right so now we have only one table so this is just for that right and if something uh, there is a problem uh, to delete so record not deleted boot box dot alert uh, this is a record is not deleted so let me show you this file ajax file so ajax file is here and here is just i have added my connection file database connection file and if id is set because uh, this id this id is exactly should be matched to here this id so we are uh, getting through dollar underscore post and this id and we are storing this id to this id variable and we are using uh, uh, this query delete query delete from post table where id is whatever id and whatever uh, post you want to delete right and echo is one and this one is exactly here if response if response is equals to equals to one right if you add a two here and so you have to also modify here is two and you can now uh, success and you can echo anything but just this is uh, means this one right so response is two we are deleting uh, we are adding a background tomato color it's background tomato color and fade out is six uh, eight hundred and remove uh, the row right so and just simply exit and if response is one you can also means this one it will run this this block if response is zero your data is not recorded uh, deleted for that right so just simply uh, this is a small uh, query i have added for deleting uh, item from post table right so i think uh, pretty much we have a done let me yeah css i don't have a uh, taught you so this is a container and container margin top is 50 pixels because uh, let me show you let's 10 pixels so this table this container right so this table will start from here let me refresh so you can see this is just for that right so the source code is available in a video description you can go through the link and you can get a source code so it's free and you can get a source code right so pretty much we have it done if you have any questions and doubt you can write me uh, uh, a comment in a comment box i'll help you uh, 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 i'll reply you uh, if any question uh, you can feel free to uh, write your question so thanks for watching and uh, uh, we will see you soon till then bye have a nice day bye bye